souried and we're gonna go ahead and mix work in this so you know how it goes um, I'll read the cards and then tell you the sign it's for after um, and I'm gonna speed this up but if you can um, if you will please hit the like and subscribe um, so I can pull more from your energy while I'm shuffling these out. It will be greatly appreciated. It is free for you, but it helps out my channel greatly. Okay, so I'm going to fast forward this and I will see you guys in a minute. start here well this <laughs> uh, I was hoping we were gonna start with a good one okay but we're not um, there is someone who is gonna be this The only thing I'm getting for the suite is that you're going to learn a lesson from this. Like, this is a lesson that you're going to need going forward. I mean, it's going to suck because someone here is, someone here does not have the best interest for you. And this could be someone who flirts with you at work. Someone could possibly try almost get you fired um, be careful with sexual harassment um, make sure to watch who you're around who you say things to um, there's a possibility someone could stick up for you but you still have someone in your energy this week who is not gonna look at you in the best light um, but definitely, definitely watch what you're doing at work. Gemini. All right, Gemini, be very cautious for who you speak to and the way that you speak to them at work. Um, yeah, that, that's all I'm getting. Okay, so this sign, yeah, what I'm getting for the sweet is, you know, that there was the sweet, that there was a test of strength. Okay, usually we don't like here and we're going to have tests, right? However, usually once we pass those tests, if we pass them with good flying colors, then usually we get a reward at the end. Um... This could be something that you do and it wears you out this week. But, you know, um, if it has to do with work, it could be, you know, you're putting in a lot of extra work. But you're going to get that breakthrough that you need. You're going to get that, that come up or this completion. Like you get the job done kind of deal. This could be... If it, it also if it's at work it could be someone who's testing to see how hard you work and it, it's literally gonna wear you out yeah because even I'm yawning now Vir <laughs> Virgo for all those who don't know I am a Virgo that's how I feel already but I've not I've not felt so good this week All right, this sign, sweet and sour. <laughs> 
what the heck? <laughs> what the heck? Someone may be wanting to take a trip, but they end up like, it's kind of, I don't know if this is meaning like, someone wants to take a vacation, but then all of a sudden they can't go because somebody ends up being on maternity leave. That <laughs> Maybe there was somewhere you didn't want, you don't want to go. Maybe there's somewhere you didn't want. Oh my goodness. Sorry, there's somewhere you didn't want to go. You wanted to go somewhere where it's calm, where it, where you can find balance, where you can be at peace. And for a few of you have heard, is someone at the workplace, like if you work with somebody who has kids and they like have their kids with them at work, like they're going to leave with their kids and it's going to make it more peaceful. Either that or Or there's a pos I just heard another story. Someone at work who could be pregnant, who's been driving you completely batshit crazy, is going to finally leave on maternity leave and it is going to make the week more peaceful. <laughs> Cancer. <laughs> also, don't uh, get anybody pregnant at work. Because that definitely definitely would be bad if you got somebody pregnant at work and then you could not leave that situation because you got them pregnant that would be awful apprentice okay so it looks like somebody is um Looks like somebody is getting a new job. They're going to be training. Um, the sour is it, it. It's possible that it's a not. It's a not shift. Um, you know, you may be ready to reap what you um, sow. But there's possibly, there's a lot of secrets. So whatever you do, make sure that you're doing everything by the book so you don't get in legal trouble. I don't know if you have your own business um, by any chance. You need to make sure to keep up with the records so you know the IRS doesn't come and you know, it's, it's kind of like, you know, um, if you sold marijuana in one town, it's fine. But if you sold it in another town, you know, it's perf it's completely illegal. So whatever it is, just make sure you're doing everything by the book. You know, make sure you're, everything's up to code. Make sure everything is where it's supposed to be. Libra. I just heard and don't be a hooker. <laughs> All right, next sign. Well, whatever sign this is, you're going to get money. 
but whatever this week you're just going to be super emotional However you get money, it's going to be super stressful. Like, I don't know if this is your job that is super stressful. Like, so much so, you're going to be like, I can't deal with this shit this early in the morning. I need my coffee. Like, give me a fucking minute. Like, so, it's going to drive you batshit crazy and it's going to stress you out a little bit. But, you're going to get the money from it. Like, maybe that's the whole reason why you're doing this job is for the money. Aquarius. Either way, this week you're going to need some coffee. Alright, next sign. Alright, the sweet is you're going to have some time alone. The sour is literally you're going to be have so much anxiety because something new is coming to the light or a baby is being born you know again a baby is being born now this could be someone is Someone is finding out they're pregnant and it's stressing them out and they are spending time alone trying to figure out how to tell the person that they're with or you are just being told that someone you slept with is pregnant. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Hopefully, again, you know, with the cancer because I've been reading that for cancer for quite a while, you know, like... If you are not wanting to be with somebody long term, like in a full commitment, like have children with this person, do not sleep with anybody right now that you are not wanting to make a baby with. Sagittarius. What the junk? I don't want to, I, I don't want to read this. Sagittarius, I'm just going to say this. If you have a female energy in your, um, energy, uh, in your life who is important to you, you could be saying goodbye to them. And I don't know if that is forever. You could be finding out someone that you cared for has passed on, you know. Or is sick. Someone is breaking the news. So just Sagittarius, if you have female people in your life that are important, just for the next little while, just show them extra love. Whether it's them that this is talking about or not, just, just show them extra love, okay? Just through the holiday season, you know, if you love somebody, let them know. Sweet is your pausing to take, um, to figure out what it is that you want. find out what it is that's important to you. It's like, so let's take your time to figure out what they want. Why? Because there's a, like a misunderstanding. 
Yeah, because something has blown up way too much. Something has been blown up and people have been hurt. You know, they've got their heart broken. And so somebody's standing back trying to figure out what to do to fix it. You know, like if something blew up at work, you know, somebody could be like, you know, talking to somebody trying to figure out how it works or how to fix it or you know kind of like if something goes down at your job someone's trying to call somebody else to figure out how to fix it um and it could be you know like uh It could be emotional, like extremely emotional. Like someone could get really mad and you could get really emotional or you could get really mad because something gets down, uh, broken and they get really emotional. Either way, somebody's gonna get their heart broken. But a female is gonna get her heart broken. If there are two females, Scorpio, if there are two females and say if you are fighting over someone or something, the blonde, and I don't care if your hair has been dyed purple or green or whatever, if your hair has ever been blonde, you are gonna be the one that gets your heart broken because shit's gonna blow up because someone with dark hair is going to be watching like, what the fuck are you doing? So hopefully, hopefully you're the one with the dark hair, Scorpio, because it looks like someone with blonde hair is trying to cross a boundary, possibly with somebody's person who has dark hair, um, like natural dark hair, and shit is about to blow up. Somebody's going to get their heart broken. Somebody could also be finding out, like a blonde or a light color hair person could be finding out that someone is in a relationship with somebody with dark hair and it breaks the heart because they wanted to try to be with, I don't know, it's freaking, I, hopefully you understand it more than I do. Sorry, Scorpio. Like, if you have dark hair, I have a feeling that it's going to be the other person in the story that cries, okay? Hopefully that helps. I just heard another story. <laughs> oh my gosh. If you have dark hair and you have a daughter, there's a possibility her car could blow up. Not like blow up, blow up, but her something could go wrong with her car. Um, or someone's friends could, they could be fighting with their friends. It, if, if it's a, if you have dark hair and there's a young female in your energy, they could be fighting with somebody. I take it as a resonates. Okay. I don't even get the sweet here. This is in reverse. Your sweet is what's sour and your sour is what's sweet. <laughs> Pretty much what this is saying is that someone is getting super grumpy. Someone's going to be super grumpy this week. Um, It's kind of like they're going to self-sabotage. 
but but spirit saying, listen, you're going to self-sabotage, but it's more in your head than it is actually out in the world. So like, calm the fuck down. <laughs> stop being grumpy as, as F, you know, like stop being grumpy. Like this is in your head. Stop trying to force things. You've got this, you know, you've got the nine of swords, ace of swords. <laughs> The Ace of Swords. So, in other words, you have the Ten of Swords. The Ten of Swords is the ending of the awful swords, you know, like, you know, the truth is going to come out that it may be more in your head than, than what you think. And once you hit the Ten of Swords, that's the ending of the toughness, of the pain, of... It's moving into a better cycle. and But you're just like grumpy as fuck getting out of it. Aries. Alright, Aries. Just hold on to your feathers, little bird. You got this. Okay. <laughs> First of all, don't do crack, kids. Crack. Crack is bad, okay? Drugs are bad, okay? Drugs are bad. So, the sweet here is that you're in the energy of wanting to learn everything, wanting to, um, find out everything, find out all the details, you know, or anything like that. But it's like, I don't know. It, 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 I'm getting still the training, the training energy. It's like someone tells you how to do something 5,000 times. But even when they tell you how to do something 5,000 times, like you're like, oh my God, oh my God, do I, okay, well, I'm going to do this, then I'm going to do this, then I'm going to do this, then I'm going to go do this. Even though you've been trained and you could do it side by side with somebody because they told you all the details of how to do it. It's kind of like you're paranoid, like, And also somebody needs to drink some water because you're going to get dehydrated. And stop over, stop stressing out. You got the Knight of Swords that goes to the King of Swords. So it's kind of like you're leveling up and this week I'm feeling... <laughs> you're not going to have a whole lot of love because you're going to be so freaking stressed out. Like, and for some of you guys, like, you're trying to find out what the truth is. Um, some of you guys are wanting to see if the person that you're with is cheating. And so you are going into the energy of trying to pick every single detail because, I mean, some of you guys, you guys want to find out if there's love here. And I don't know if it's on your side or, no, or I don't know if it's on their side, but it could just be you. Um, controlling your emotions because, I mean, there, there was no water in these cups, which means there's a, no emotion. This is somebody who's controlling their emotions too much. Too much to where they're trying to numb themselves. Someone's trying to numb themselves. They could be using drugs to numb themselves or alcohol to numb themselves. But either way, you know, this is somebody who's wanting to find out the truth. I, I just heard someone could be trying to get somebody drunk to find out the truth. Um... Or give somebody crack <laughs> or drugs to find out the truth of what actually went on I don't know or somebody's trying to find out what actually the truth of what happened 
with somebody who was put who was on drugs and why what happened to them happened Pisces all right Pisces um, if you are on drugs or your person is on drugs someone is going to try to find out the answer and let's hope it's not at work and you don't get fired all right next sign Wheel of Fortune to the Knight of Wands. <laughs> okay. Alright, so there's going to be a shit show that happens, and that's obvious. Um, but I have a feeling that this week it's going to be easily um, worked through and figured out. I, I just like see somebody like resting their hand on their head, being like, oh, this is ever going to end. This is taking forever. Why do I got to listen to all these people talk about their shit? But it, it could be, it could just be, um, someone walking into like an argument or a place that's full of chaos and they're just like, all right, well, we're going to take this easy. Uh, we're going to take a five minute nap here or, uh. A recess or nap time and then we're gonna make sense out of everything okay but we need to this this could be someone who's saying we need to sleep on it tonight and then come back and deal with it in the morning because what the fuck is this shit <laughs> geez a lot of people are getting major oh what sign was this sorry guys that was Capricorn all right Capricorn Well, nothing else. It looks like you could be actually taking a break for once. Alright, so... This is somebody who judgment's being called upon. Whether it's you or your person, um... Because something has to be released. Like, I don't know if it's a divorce. I don't know if it's a breakup. I don't know if it's a losing a certain job. Um, I don't know if a breakup happened. Because someone was greedy and selfish. But if this is the case, so say, say it's you. And you are, your post, person broke up with you or you're breaking up, you're thinking about breaking up with your person. What I'm seeing here is the one co co-worker who can see things from a higher perspective, if nothing else, at least something on the top shelf. Like, so this is somebody, you're going to go to somebody or they're going to go to somebody who can see things from a higher perspective. Somebody who's done this thing already. Somebody who's a bit already been there. Someone who will actually tell them, uh, give them advice from a higher perspective. Someone who's not just going to tell them what they want to hear, but what they need to hear to better their life. That's, that's pretty much all I'm getting, Taurus. Either way, your the results of your test are coming in. That I 
I just heard different perspective. This, this, someone could want a second opinion on a test that comes in or need to see a second a second specialist or something like that you know like go to a specialist or a counselor or something like that or you know like a coach like a life coach or a relationship coach or something like that someone who could see something from a higher perspective anyways sorry that that just kept getting okay sweet and sour sweet <laughs> I don't know if you're finding money and you're like sweet because you love money or you just come into some money unexpectedly um, let's see here. Okay, so you could be finding extra money, like you could get a raise or whatever, but what it's going to do, I have a feeling, is that it's going to ground you so hard that you're going to end up being stuck with all of the work. And you could end up being like the black sheep because, you know, you don't eat rainbows and fart skittles. Uh, you could go in there and just end up doing your work and then you ended up being the one who... kind of just gets pushed off or whatever to just do the work like everything just gets pushed off on you so whatever this is you know stay in your grounds make sure you're not doing everything make sure you see the fine print before you know you sign on the dotted lines in any in any area at all okay leo all right leo Right. You could also be stuck somewhere in a work position because you need the money. And you feel like you're trying, you're having to do more work than what you're supposed to. Yeah. But I have a feeling uh, some of you guys are learning, you know, that once you level up in your area that it will be good for you as well you know it's like well, once I move up to this and I become manager you know I'll work more hours but it'll be easier hours to work or something like that I don't know so anyways that's what I have for you guys if you like this video please hit like and subscribe down below um, so you'll get notified of my next videos and there's my alarm. It's time to wake up my son for school. Um, but that way you'll get notified of the next videos. It is free for you. Um, but it helps out my channel greatly to help me grow. Um, anyways, that's what I got for you guys. Till next time, as always, stay weird. Bye.